We've wrapped up our congressional district for debate this evening. It was between Democrat incumbent Stephen Horsford and his Republican challenger, Sam Peters. David Charnes has the breakdown of all the topics discussed. Welcome to our Congressional District for debate. Democratic Congressman Stephen Horsford and the man looking to replace him, Republican Sam Peters, couldn't have proven they are more different. Uh, my opponent has uh, continuously uh, voted to um, spend more money and more money, and it's not going to get better. That's why my opponent is extreme. He's out of touch. He does not reflect the priorities of the people of Nevada's 4th District. Peters painting Horsford as a member of the Democratic establishment. We've seen it again month after month after month, 40-year uh, highs on inflation. It's not getting better. Horsford saying Peters is a radical Republican, out of touch with reality. This is greedflation based on big oil, uh, big uh, gas companies that are trying to gouge consumers at a time when we need to be working to lower costs. From pandemic loans Peters received and lockdowns. How do you justify taking that loan while also criticizing the spending? So the government shut down small business across the country, shut down the entire economy for two years. Horsford responded the money that helped pay Peter's employees came through bipartisan legislation. My opponent doesn't want to talk about the pandemic okay. that also was killing lives and affecting livelihoods. On the issue of abortion, Peter says it's settled law in Nevada. Horsford attacked him for saying politicians shouldn't dictate school policy, but Republicans want to pass a national abortion ban. My opponent is anti-choice and wants uh, politicians in Washington to decide what women and doctors Not should true. do. I have no desire to steal women's health care. I am married to a woman. I have two daughters. Um, there is no, no sensible argument that can be made to say that I want to steal women's health care. Peters asking voters to choose him. Mr. Horsford was right on one thing. The, the differences could not be more stark. As Congressman Horsford seeks another term. The choice could not be more clear in uh, the decision on who voters will decide to elect to represent you um, in Nevada's fourth. I'm asking for your support. That was David Charnes reporting.